Hi, my name is Casey Rose and the purpose of this video is to share some of the professional dispositions that I currently hold as well as those that I'd really like to improve on. One of the professional dispositions that I currently hold myself to is providing the opportunity and support for every student to learn regardless of their circumstances or the foundation of education that they've had thus far. Another disposition that I currently hold is that educators should be involved in the local community. We are investing into the lives of the future. The communities that we live in vary from place to place and to adequately support, encourage, and cater to the community that we are sending our students to in the future, we need to know what it is now and the direction that it's headed. Also, I think that having a servant's heart and serving both the school and the community helps us to have a more holistic view of our culture and therefore customize the learning experiences that we are providing. A couple of areas that I really would like to grow in in these disposition areas are that Educators should promote and support curiosity and encourage active inquiry. This is something that is intriguing to me and not something that I have a lot of experience in yet at this point. And it is something I plan to continue to learn more about. Also, educators recognizing and reflect, reflecting on combined experience um, to lead to growth is important to be in pursuit of because as educators, the times and needs are constantly changing and it's important for us to continue learning as well. So it's important for myself, for growth, that I continue to learn ways that I'm able to participate in different types of trainings and also glean from the learning community that I'm a part of. Additionally, there are a lot of different types of appearances and behaviors that educators can possess. Some of the things that I think are most important are appearing to be clean and making an effort to present yourself confidently, standing upright with a confident posture, because especially when handling uh, different types of behavior or instilling the confidence into students as well as modeling that for them, then the way that we carry ourselves can really make a difference. Also, smiling and ensuring that the words that we're saying as well as the actions that we are carrying out are in alignment, which builds trust and reliability both with our students as well as our administration and our teacher peers. Finally, I think it is really important as an educator to be team oriented. Many things that we run into will involve deciding what is best for the team and what the team needs versus what we would prefer. So being able to recognize when we need to negotiate or when we need to try something that someone else presents versus doing things our way is key to building a culture within our schools that the educators and administration can all be collaboratively working together for the success of the students. Thank you for your opportunity to share.